actually dropped more weight in two years than those who did not. Cranking your AC may also be to blame for eating too much. One study found people who sat in a room with a temperature of 81 degrees had a 20 percent decrease in their appetite. According to the American Heart Association, peripheral artery disease, or PAD, affects more than 8 million Americans. The disease develops when leg arteries become clogged with plaque, fatty deposits that limit blood flow to the legs. People suffering from PAD are four to five times more at risk of heart attack and stroke. Fortunately, a local hospital is making use of a new device and procedure to treat PAD. Eyewitness News reporter Kate Larson joins us now from the Eyewitness Newsroom to explain how a little diamond dust is saving lives and limbs. Kate? Lisa, just last week, Dr. Soto at the Bakersfield Heart Hospital performed the first ever orbital arthrectomy here in Kern County. The procedure saved a 67-year-old man's leg from amputation and quite possibly saved his life. The non-invasive procedure uses a small diamond-coated crown that is advanced into the femoral artery under x-ray image. Once inside the blocked artery, the crown spins around at high speeds to sand away hard, rock-like plaque that is blocking blood flow to the lower legs and feet that would otherwise be untreatable. Basically pulverizes the plaque making a very tiny little fragments the size of a red, a red blood vessel that are washed away with the circulation. I think with this particular device we were able to save many many legs from being amputated. Dr. Soto said the procedure took 20 minutes and was able to provide completely new blood flow to the patient's left leg and foot, which because of the lack of circulation had developed gangrene and would likely have needed to be amputated. Dr. Soto has several patients scheduled for the new procedure in the next few weeks. For Eyewitness Health Alert, I'm Kate Larson. Lisa, back to you. Thanks, Kate.